The victim and some friends had just left the Grind Gastro Pub on Granada Boulevard, heading to this parking lot across the street, when they noticed a man leaning on the victim's vehicle parked here. Police say this is that man in a green shirt after he attacked the victim and jumped on top of her. Investigators and pub owner Kevin Wakefield are anxious to identify him, widely circulating a brief cell phone video on social media that caught the end of the assault. Wakefield says the victim had asked the suspect to move away from her vehicle. She asked him again a little more sternly, please get off my car, um, at which point he grabbed her, headbutted her to the ground and um, jumped on top of her and, and gave her a few blows to the face. According to police, neither the victim nor her friends knew the suspect. It doesn't appear he'd been inside the pub. So the random nature of the attack concerns Wakefield, who not only owns the grind, but two other nearby restaurants. My first priority and my first obligation is the safety of my staff and our customers. Wakefield says he's beefing up his late night security staff and says any female patron can ask for an escort. This is the first such occurrence we've had uh, and I'm, I'm really dedicated to making sure this is the last. The suspect took off in a silver passenger car. Unfortunately, the tag number not seen in that video. Pub owner Wakefield was offering a $2,000 reward for information leading to an arrest, but just today, upped it to $3,000. He's hoping it's an incentive that resolves a disturbing crime. In Ormond Beach, Volusia County, Claire Metz, West 2 News.